<laughs> you realize, like, even lobster is, like, $7 a pound, right? Yeah, but, I mean, this is, like, this is ice. <laughs> it's like a lot of ice. <laughs> like, look at that. That's bigger than any ice cube I guarantee that you would find in any other restaurant. Yes. I mean, I'm having trouble because it's uh, too big to fit in my glass, yet not big enough to make a house out of. <laughs> so I'm having trouble. Well, this is, the, this is the, the ice hut. It's not like an, ice, an igloo. We are, it's not made a hut. But if you could explain to me the difference between an ice hut and an igloo, I would be very, very... <laughs> an ice hut is a hut where you find ice. An igloo is uh, a building made of ice. <laughs> that is very no. hut-ish. Well, it could be in the shape of a hut. <laughs> <laughs> you go to Pizza Hut and it's not made of pizza. <laughs> right up there on the wall. This place is made of pizza. Get it? I, I know, I know. <laughs> step one, we need to stop letting random strangers into the factory. Yeah. Step two, now I know how much you love birds. Oh, so much. And I don't want to question your decision to, to, to found an auto planter next to the aviary. But, with the reports in, there is an average of 12 dead birds in every car we ship. <laughs> and people are- Cut to one of those every car! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Cut that! And occasionally several live birds! <laughs> two options, right? Okay. Uh, we either move or we build walls. <laughs> Birds can't get it. <laughs> you saw that as well as I. Sorry, I'm, I'm not going to do any more hands here. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> You build balls to keep the birds out. I can't get in anymore either. <laughs> And well, I think the good solution would be what if, instead of just making cars, what if we just sell the birds? Like dead bird for sale. I love them. I know. Come to me. I mean, I, I feel like if I love them, Everyone should love them. If everyone doesn't love them, I should force them. Let's let's, let's, let's one person. All right, um, ma'am, ma'am, excuse me. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, yes. Um, do you own a car? Yes, I do. Yes, yes. Do you own uh, a dead bird? No, I don't. But I've always put it on a list of things I should get at the grocery store. <laughs> Birds fly me over there. <laughs> to get a car or a dead bird. And if you didn't get the dead bird, something bad would happen. Which one would you choose? Definitely the bird, sir. But, but is that because of the bird ah, or the... Ah, the... Ah, ah, ah. <laughs>
<laughs> All right, let's look at the list. You have a, a bike, a pony. I've been walking everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> All the other kids make fun of me and throw rocks at me on their bikes. You want a TV, a PlayStation, a five pound bar of chocolate, and a cat. These are, you, bear, you feel you, bear, you really need those. Okay, I mean, we go on and it gets bigger. You ask for a plane. <laughs> and I, I'm just thinking logical progression. Eventually, I'll want to fly places. <laughs> but you realize that some of these things I just can't give you. You start, you go on, you, you ask for a girlfriend. I don't know. <laughs> I have so many friends. <laughs> what you want? Uh, no, we're not going to go down. I love Colby. <laughs> Santa could come and take the test for me. He knows everything. <laughs> and he could throw his magical nose dust at the test. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Santa might be working at the time you have to test me for. I can. Okay. All right. I'm Honey, I mean, the, the last one you... I mean, well, you, you did ask for world peace, which is sort of ridiculous. That is so also, honey, giving of me. <laughs> the, one, the one that I have the most problem with, honey, is you ask... It's my favorite. You ask for... You ask for love, honey. It's not... I'm still lost. <laughs> I don't get it, Charles. Why can't I keep work? Not much to get, William. I, I was working at the Dead Bird Factory, but that just shut down. <laughs> I was I was I was a mall Santa Claus, but apparently Santa can't have magical nose dust in it. <laughs> More than any other man I have ever known, suck. <laughs> there it is. We're done.